Blunt force trauma to the head, is that correct? It appears so. Good catch. Morning, detective. Morning, Gwen. Morning, neighbor. Looks like she fell down the stairs. I think that's what killed her. Look there. She was struck by something at the top. What about that one lady? What'd she say? The witness? I know someone pushed that woman down the stairs. What do you think, detective? I can tell you what I think if you tell me what happened. Well, I had just gotten home from work and I was headed to my apartment and then I saw this woman. The one who pushed the other one down the stairs. She was just... staring at me. And what do you remember about them? I don't know much, but consider this. How do you think people would react if they found out that Sherlock fucking Holmes is beating people over the head? <laughs> I... I think they would say that's ridiculous. It just it doesn't make sense. What'd you find, detective? She speaks nonsense. What did you notice about that apartment complex? I... I don't think that I know. Notice how everybody greeted each other? They all knew each other. So... I find it suspicious that Audrey, who supposedly lived in the nearby apartment for years, can't recall the face of one of the residents. So you're saying... What I'm saying is that if there was a, another person there, there would be evidence of that. I only found fingerprints of two people at the scene. No hair sample, no murder weapon, no nothing. Just fingerprints. Just fingerprints. Just fingerprints is all that could have been found there. We found our culprit. You did good today. Job again? Mm. <laughs>